Well, hello, Spring Forward, and happy Wednesday. I hope this video finds you well and you're enjoying what is a pretty warm day outside, I believe. Uh, just a couple of very brief announcements. First, I want to start. I'm very excited about this. This is School Counselor Week. All week this week, uh, our school counselors uh, every day offer support to students, parents, and staff in so many ways. This week, we all want to join together and celebrate them uh, for School Counseling Week. Uh, very important role in our community, in our schools, and supporting our students. So make sure you reach out to your school counselor, your child's school counselor, and just wish them a fantastic, fantastic week. Certainly, they deserve it every week of the year, uh, but this day, this week is dedicated to them. And yesterday, very excitingly, certainly at our elementary schools, we celebrated the 100th day of school. That means we're now well over the uh, well over the halfway point, and uh, we are now moving towards summertime fun activities and a time for us to take a break for a little while. Again, as I mentioned, the elementary levels, uh, a lot of great uh, videos I saw, great pictures of students dressing up as if they were 100 years old. Always a fun time. This upcoming Saturday, uh, we are hosting a VEX Robotics competition in the, in the uh, gymnasium at our ninth grade center. It's free to come in and check it out. Uh, we have a lot of teams. I think I believe we have eight teams from our high school um, that are all competing with other school districts um, on the on tasks. They design a robot, they build a robot, and then they train the robot. They program the robot to do specific tasks, and they get rated on their performance. Um, they get rated on a few different categories. So uh, please make sure you join our our Spring Forward Rambots Robotics team. Uh, this Saturday, the 11th, the 9th grade center. The event, as I said, is free. Uh, and it starts while they start at 8 o'clock with check-in and all that stuff. I believe the event goes live right around 10 o'clock um, where the com competitions begin. And lastly, there's been a lot of interest about some game that's happening on Sunday. I think they call it the Super Bowl, and our birds are in it. And we certainly support the birds, and we're looking forward to uh, we're looking forward to their their victory. But let's address the underdog in the room. Oh, we have an underdog back there. Hi, underdog. Now, not really the underdogs. Back in 2018 when they won the Super Bowl, that was definitely an underdog moment there. But this one, we're anticipating they're going to win and they're going to bring home their second Super Bowl victory. So we certainly support and wish the birds well as they go into that game on Sunday. We will be celebrating them in much the same fashion we celebrated the World Series this year with our Phillies, uh, with Spirit Days. Uh, we're going to have a Spirit Day this Friday, celebration videos, etc. Uh, and in terms of, you know, staying up to watch the game, as always, you know, we defer to parents in terms of making the decision for what's best for their child in terms of school attendance. Uh, we, we're going to be open on, on normal time on Monday. And again, I know there was uh, there were some thoughts about that. Um, so certainly some emails that I received, uh, but we're going to be consistent with how we've celebrated this. And uh, we look forward once again to the birds doing very well. That's all we have this week. Uh, thanks again. Have a great week. Go birds. And we'll see you next Wednesday. Take care.